Okay, Sly. It's time for Ryuichi to reclaim his sushi restaurant. It looks like the front door is the only entrance. We need to get rid of that guard if we're going to get Ryuichi inside. However, security is on high alert since we broke him out of jail, and we can't risk raising an alarm. I think this one is going to require some misdirection. What do you mean? I bet if you wore that samurai armor you stole, you'd be able to relieve that guard at the front door. Right. Plus, I just look good in armor. Police! I hope he means relieve by... Stand. I don't want break. any more problems. I hope he means relieve by break time is what I meant to say, because... The other word for relief is not something. Dismiss. In case you heard that, that was me turning up the TV's volume. I, was, I usually use my Wii mode, I mean my Wii U, uh, to upload. I mean, uh, put up the volume. I guess I don't need to tell you about your own place. Quite ingenious of you to use your sushi knives as door keys, by the way. Entity son. I... That's that's makes sense. Right. Uh my bad. Anyway, my scan reveals your sushi knives are still here. The bad news is the guards definitely have them. There are also some security traps you've definitely never seen before. Entity son, though the bamboo forest is dense, water flows through it without effort. Oh uh, yeah. Just be careful not to alert the guards. Now get those knives and take your restaurant back. Mm, I was on Okay. So um so I locked in that cage. Let me recall so in dragon technique. Okay, so basically, um, all the Sly Cooper ancestors, they actually have their own special abilities. Like, Ryoichi, he's got this silent sprint. And if we go up here, as he will explain... I need to press and hold the R2 button to gather my focus, while using the left stick to direct my energy towards a target. Okay, yeah. So it's basically like that. Over there, we'll get our next slime mask. Like, um, there are a few things hidden in the Sly Cooper series, like hidden slime masks. You just gotta make sure to watch out for them. I make sure to do that. Here is the first guard we need to get. Make sure not to get the, the searchlights on you, because that would be bad. First, I will reclaim my knives. Then, I will show El Jefe this shop cannot be closed. Okay, so we got the first uh, knife. Only cut sushi properly with a knife. This now I'm... It appears my knife looks... Now I'm gonna kill this guy. Another thing about Ryoichi 
is um, that he's actually got the silent obliteration like uh, Sly Cooper. Okay. And he jumps in there with a bunch of backflips like the awesome ninja he is. Of these traps will provide a challenge. Sly and his friends are strong. I'll wait for this guy to fall asleep. Truly in their debt. See? He's got a silent spread. Okay. Now over here we should be getting the next uh, knife. Alright, now we got the fillet knife. My finest knife. My Jimmy will be perfect. Alright, Ryuichi. Only one more knife to go. Okay, now this is going to be a little bit tricky. we got to make sure to time our jumps. Like, these uh, bon bonsai trees, they break after a while you're on there. See? you got to make sure to be careful there. got to make sure to time your jumps. Make sure those bonsai trees don't break. I really must clear this place. Make sure not to get captured over here, because that's obviously. First, I will reclaim my knife. Then, I will show El Jefe this shop cannot be closed. Okay. Okay, so we're almost there. All we need to get is just one more knife and get past one more death trap. Got his cleaver. One day I will bring greatness to this shop again. Okay, so in this area, we'll actually be getting our next slime mask. Okay, now let's turn on the sign and get rid of these, uh, guards. So that was basically the um, the first mission for Ryuichi, featuring Ryuichi. Um, and now we're about to go do our next mission, which should be in the hideout right now. Oh, and we got some good stuff in Thief now. Okay, here we sh we're going to unlock the Silent Obliteration and the El Drapo for Sly and Murray. And, uh, since Murray's so excited, we'll play as him first. Now he wants to disguise herself as the Black Baron. That is a foreshadowing. Make sure you watch out for that. Okay. No 
don't want to. I don't want to see if I can make it by double jumping. That's how you obliterate someone with Murray. Since we went fishing. Okay, I guess we're just gonna ignore that. I'm excited! Well, this is no vacation, Murray. We need to help Ryuichi get back on track as a sushi chef. And what he needs most right now is fish. We're here because these caves are his secret spot for catching the best fish. Unfortunately, judging from this security lock, it looks like El Jefe's been here too. Can you open it, buddy? Are you kidding? I've never met a system I couldn't hack. Don't worry, Murray. We'll be fishing in no time. Okay. So right now we should be heading into one of Bentley's new hack hacking things. See right here. Uh, we're turned into Rambo Bentley. All right. Navigation is smooth and steady. The right stick should fire by binary. Okay, so it's actually pretty simple. It's, it's pretty much just like the uh, first hacking, like uh, L to move, R to shoot. Ion bits to level up! Of course, by combining multiple ionic particles, I can supercharge my attack! But taking damage will drop my... Okay, and as you saw... Anyway, as you saw, uh, if we pick up five stars, we'll be able to level up and we'll be able to do more damage. But as Bentley explained, if we get hit, we'll lose one upgrade. That'll be bad. And that blue orb that we just picked up, uh, it's actually a grenade. If you press R1, you uh, can cause an explosion like this, see? Okay, so it looks like we just uh, upgraded to um, missile launcher, but we just lost that, and now we gained it back. Back. Um, so as you can, like, if you look at the uh, upgrade slot, then you can see what exactly we up we upgrade. Like, we just upgrade triple triple bullets. Up there, that red star will upgrade us automatically if we get it. Okay, so we just got ourselves a faster shelter. Okay, so we should be getting near the boss of the hacking. Right here we got a whole bunch of uh, upgrades, but I guess I just wasted them. Oh. Okay. Sometimes what I like to do is I like to go kamikaze and at the end I just run in there and set off a bomb. Must have I, bad directions. I, okay. And there we go. That was the second hack, hack um, thing for Bentley. What more battery I have left. Alright. So if you hear all that mashing in the background, that's probably me mashing the button. Okay, Murray, we need to find the secret fishing hole. Let's try that gate over there. 
Think you could open it? No problem, chum. Fresh fish coming up. Okay. So now we gotta get over there so we can get the fresh fish. Luckily there's no guards around here so we could run and Hold up, Barry. But over here. Mammoth lightning bugs will give you a nasty shock. Lucky for us, that large plant is a giant lamp leaf. Hitting it will make it glow and attract the bugs. Give it a whack and get those things out of our way. Awesome! You know how much Okay. So as Bentley said, we have to light up this so we could jump over to that platform so those uh, electric beetles won't get to us. And over here, we gotta make sure to time it, make sure we don't get jabbed. Be careful jumping on those lily okay. pads, Murray. This is one situation where your muscle mass may be problematic. Okay, so that lamp over there is too far for us to punch, so we gotta make sure to use this rock to throw it from afar. Let's hurry! The fish should be biting right now! Alright, let's hurry up. And, you know, be warned if you get to... Oh! Alright, it's so dark. Anyway, be warned when you get to this part, you have to use six axis controls. Oh my super saiyan god, the six axis controls are terrible. I mean, like, over here, it's pretty easy. Without a real fishing pole, I'm gonna have to use this old magnet for Murray's toy robot. I've calibrated its output to coincide with the fish's own bioelectric fields, so if I can keep it close enough, it should attract them like a charm. Talk about animal magnetism. I just need to tilt like this to move it around. Wait, how does that work? A delectable spotted snake mouth. I mean... It's not like they conduct electricity, so they wouldn't be attracted to it. The Lansky! Yes! A superb... Like Cooper Logic, I guess. Yep, a beautiful large mouth horse face! Wow! This one's huge! Over here, you little... Nice catch, pal! Yeah, that big eyed bug eater. Got to stay over this guy. All right. Okay, Barry. Hey. Now we got enough fish to head back. Yeah, make sure you be careful though. <coughs> so, Activate that plant. Swall swallows it. Um. Anyway, make sure you be careful with this because if you drop it. Destroy it or fall uh, in an endless pit, then you will fail automatically fail the mission. Shoot! I need some more fish. Yeah, and for this part, just make sure you aim for the car. So, uh, what? What the hell happened? I, I thought it landed in in the car. Hurry! Take that fish to the car. I guess I have to do it on the ground. I just wanted to make sure I didn't hit any lightning beetles. Okay, over here. Oh, okay, there we go. Alright. Now we gotta light this thing up. And take this back over to the main cart. Right here, we really got time. I just gotta throw it over there and light this thing up. There we 
All right. And we should be done right about now. Man, this is a serious load. Oh, do you think Ryoichi will make us some sushi as a reward? I'm not sure, but let's just get this fish back to him without El Jefe's goons turning us into sashimi. Never fear, Bentley. Nobody makes a hippo roll out of the Murray. All right. So we basically just finished, uh, this next part of Sly Cooper Thieves in Time for the PlayStation 4. Any minute now we should be getting back to the high. Okay, so uh, I really want to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you all leave a like, comment, subscribe so you can support my channel so I'll keep uploading more stuff like this. And I'll see you guys next time. Later, my fellow otakus.